Benefit number two, the benefits of using customer feedback to improve beat sales. You'll create a stronger producer-artist relationship. Man, this is dope, man. We touched on it a little bit earlier, but we're going to go all in now. Check this out. Make a mental note of this and jot this down wherever you write your, your notes at. You should be taking notes. Hopefully, you're taking notes. But people do business with people they know, like, and trust. Point blank, man. How does this happen? Through building real, genuine relationships. We're actively seeking out and incorporating feedback from artists and clients, significantly strengthening the relationship between us, the producer, and our audience, which are the artists buying our beats. That's our audience, okay? We're like a team with our audience and music supporters, including them by asking them what they think about our music. When we use their suggestions, it's like giving our music team a high five, making our friendship with them really strong like we can have a real relationship because we respect each other's perspective it shows that you the producer is invested in your client's success and willing to adapt to their creative vision if it benefits everyone as a whole that's key it has to benefit everyone as a whole you can't send a survey to 100 people and a couple of people on there are saying hey i like all of my beats around 60 bpms okay you can't change that for everybody if most of the people are not saying that you want to make sure that you're using wisdom about what you're changing and how you're changing up your beats to the people who you're serving okay let's use wisdom but this collaborative approach can lead to repeat business referrals and a positive reputation in the industry. Your artists and music producers are more likely to return to producers who demonstrate flexibility and commitment to meeting their needs. All right, they're going to return to you because they're like, this guy is here for me. Selling beats is a business, my friend. That's basically what I'm saying. It's a business. It's not just about being a dope producer and making dope beats. It has to be deeper than that. It's about forming a thriving community of artists and music lovers looking to support you because of your customer service and passion to connect with them on a deep deeper level. Okay? That's what it's about. People always show up. They show up every time where they're treated well. Yo, yo, we'll get back to the episode in just a few minutes, but I want to give you a free gift for rocking with me today. All right. Are you tired of your beats sitting on your hard drive collecting dust? Are you struggling to make money from all the hard work, time and effort you put into making dope music? If the answer is yes, this is the perfect time to build a profitable email list to market, promote, and sell your beats, songs, or products if you have any. All right? Just go to buildlistsellbeats.com. Buildlistsellbeats.com and download the email marketing tools for music producers checklist for free. That's right. I'm giving this game for free. You'll get access to the game-changing list of tools and resources that enable me to gain a lucrative email list with supportive listeners and music lovers ready to make a purchase. All right. Email marketing is here to stay. Check the data. 347 billion emails were sent and received per day in 2023. All right. And it's going to just increase from there. And for music producers, artists, songwriters like ourselves looking to grow and build their fan base, supporters, and bank account, may I add, all right, building an email list is the most rewarding thing you can do. Take advantage of the potential profits you can make on your musical journey by downloading the proven, neatly, well-crafted, laid-out checklist today, all right? Go to buildlistsellbeats.com and download the checklist today and turn your passion for creating music into money in your bank account. The link's in the description. Back to the episode. 